I would like to start by asking where is the glory of our gospel? The glory of a woman is in her hair. And that's why even if the face is right, she won't leave her house until the hair is right. So where is the glory of our gospel? It's not an answer I'm looking for. I'm asking you a question that you can think and contemplate. Where is the glory of our message? Jesus asked me that question as I was preparing in the morning. Where is the glory of a rich person? Where is his glory? Who can tell me? There's just one word I'm looking for. Where is the glory of a rich person? I want to see if you understand. A rich person. Where is the glory of a rich person? Huh? Huh? So where are those riches? Where? Where is his glory? So we don't have rich people. Father, in Jesus' name, may you be rich. Where is the glory of a rich person? It's in the bank. Where, not what. What is riches? Where is location? So where is the glory of a rich person? In the bank. True? Where is the glory of a farmer? Huh? So you are beginning to get it now. Where is the glory of a farmer? You know me, if you don't answer me, I will leave you and I will just teach and you will go. Where is the glory of a farmer? The farm. Where is the glory of a teacher? And I'm not talking about CW. I'm talking about the normal teacher in the school. Where is the glory of a teacher? The classroom. So where is the glory of our gospel? Where is it? Huh? 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 I can't take that for an answer because in your view you think it's location. So I cannot ignorantly take that for it will be too shallow, especially coming from CW. From some of you it's okay to say church. But from my okay, from your angle, from your angle, it that is not a weighty answer and this is why I'm not looking for an answer I'm looking for a contemplation where is the glory of our message it's in a sinless life there is no glory if there is sin there is no glory 